From the Up Coast Studios in Oklahoma City, this is an OU Update with Ryan Aber. I'm Jenny Carlson. Ryan, recruiting in full swing for the Sooners, but they've got some guys already on campus. Talk about these guys who came in a semester who maybe could have the biggest impact. Well, I think the, the number one guy is Trey Matois. He's a guy who was in that last year's signing class, had to do a semester of prep school, uh, did all right for himself there, was a little bit banged up uh, during the season uh, at their, out there at Hargrave, but uh, should be good to go for next year. He's a guy who can have a quick impact in a wide receiver core that really needs a boost. Now, they have pass catchers, a couple of them, not just Matois in this group, and maybe looking to get some more. Talk about who they're trying to bring in, what they're trying to accomplish there. Well, they've, they've got uh, uh, Taylor McNamara, who's already on campus, waiting for his, his final clearance, but he's in Norman. Uh, he's a, a big uh, hybrid tight end who can uh, catch and block. They've got Brandon Green, who's probably going to be more of a, a blocking tight end. But uh, they're also bringing in some guys uh, both last weekend, into this week, and into the final weekend of recruiting that uh, could give them uh, yet another tight end commitment. They've already got three, uh, and, and they could boost it up to four. Wow, I'm considering <laughs> they really are thin at that position. Well, you mentioned guys coming in for visits. This next weekend could be a big weekend for running backs. We know how thin that position got. Talk about who maybe they're looking to grab. Yeah, they've, they've really got a boost at that position uh, recently. They had Alex Ross uh, committed for a while. Daniel Brooks uh, from Texas is going to get a chance to play uh, running back when he gets here. But with all the uh, transfers, they needed uh, a couple more. They got a, a big commitment last week from David Smith, an Illinois high school running back. They wanted to bring in a guy who uh, has a chance to contribute immediately. And uh, Damian Williams, uh, a JUCO uh, guy, is going to be in uh, this week. And there's talk that uh, if the visit goes right, he could uh, commit pretty quick. All right, interesting stuff. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, Jay. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoman.